like and subscribe right now or you're going to have bad luck for the rest of the week. We don't normally think of plants as particularly scary organisms. In many parts of the world, there are many plants at their most dangerous. Some of these plants could actually kill you, from the most common poisonous plant to ones that feast on animals. Let's look at 10 dangerous plants that would make you want to stay indoors and hide from plants. Number 10. The Burning Bush Nope, this isn't the same plant described in the Bible. Or maybe it is. Anyway, one thing's for sure, like its biblical counterpart, this plant, as the name suggest can literally burst into flames. The name burning bush derives from the volatile oils produced by the plant, which can catch fire readily in hot weather. The daughter of Swedish botanist Carl Lanou is said to have ignited the air above these plants once at the end of a particularly hot, windless summer day using a simple matchstick. Aside from being a fire hazard, there's another reason why you should think twice about keeping these guys in your garden. All parts of this plant are highly toxic, brushing your skin against its foliage will not have an immediate effect, though, as reactions typically begin 24 hours after the fact. Initially, the skin turns red and starts to itch and burn. Large blisters form within 48 hours. The blisters may leave black, brown, or purplish scars that can last for several years. Number 9. Poison Ivy No list of dangerous plants is complete without mention of the terrible poison ivy. If you live in eastern North America, you likely know how to watch out for poison ivy's infamous leaves of three. Poison ivy and its close relatives all contain a chemical known as urushol. When touched, nearly all parts of these plants can trigger a severe, itchy, and painful skin inflammation known as contact dermatitis. Even more frightening, urushol can persist on clothing, shoes, tools, soil, or animals that have made contact with the plants, thus later poisoning an unsuspecting victim. If you've been hiking through underbrush areas with these plants, be careful to remove your clothing in such a way that the outside does not touch your skin and wash your clothing immediately. The rash can last anywhere from less than one week to more than three weeks, but does not usually require medical treatment. Number 8. Giant Hogweed It's true that giant hogweed is pretty cool looking. I mean, just look at it. It can grow up to 6 feet in height and has white flowers on top, looking like some sort of prehistoric giant. But of course, looks can be deceiving, and the sap of this plant is intensely toxic. It can cause severe burns and even blistering if it touches your bare skin, but symptoms only show up when the skin is exposed to sunlight. If the sap gets in your eyes, it can cause you to go blind. Most of all, if you you step on this plant or it gets into your blood, it can cause you quick and painful death. It is a criminal offense to plant them for a good reason in the UK. They kill children every year and are known as the most dangerous plant in Britain. To top it off, the plant likes to spread like crazy. It can produce up to 50,000 seeds per year and it's incredibly invasive, so watch your step out there. Number 7. Astropa belladonna Astropa belladonna, commonly known as belladonna or death deadly nightshade plant and belongs to the nightshade family, Solencia. It is native to Europe, North Africa, and Western Asia. It is commonly grown in woods and is often found in disturbed areas, waste places, and roadsides where it typically spreads rapidly in weed-like manner. It is a medium-sized shrub with dark green leaves and distinct purple bell-shaped flowers. Astropa belladonna is an extremely poisonous plant that contains tropane alkaloids such as astropine, scopolamine, and hyoscyamine. These toxins are mostly concentrated in the leaves, fruits, and roots of the plant. These chemicals have the power to block functions of the body's nervous system, and hence plants are considered highly poisonous. In case you ingest any part of the plant, you may encounter delirium and hallucinations, but larger doses may have the possibility of killing a human. Consumption of as few as two berries can kill a child. Contrary to all the ill effects of the plant, it also uses an anticholinergic agent to treat diseases like asthma, muscular spasms, and excessive sweating. Number 6. Tropical Pitcher Plant The main thing that distinguishes the tropical pitcher plant genus Nepenthes from other carnivorous vegetables is its scale. The pitchers of this plant can reach over a foot in height, ideal for capturing and digesting not only insects but small lizards, amphibians, and even mammals. The doomed animals are attracted to the plant's sweet-scented nectar, and once they fall into the pitcher, digestion can take as long as two months. There are about 150 Nepenthes species scattered around the eastern hemisphere, native to Madagascar, South Asia, and Australia. Also known 
known as monkey cup, the pitchers of some of these plants are used as drinking cups by monkeys, which are too large to find themselves in the wrong end of the food chain. Number 5. Angel's Trumpets Angel's Trumpets is native to Central and South America and grow either as a woody shrub or small tree. There are a variety of angel trumpets plants and size, growing conditions, and flower color may differ from each category. Its leaves are 6 to 8 inches long and bloom spectacular drooping flowers which can grow up to 20 inches long. The flower emits a strong fragrant scent that strongly attracts hummingbirds. It can grow in any kind of soil, from sand and clay to loom and richly organic mixtures. The bad side of the plant is that it is known to be extremely toxic. Angel's Trumpet contains a large number of belladonna alkaloids, also known as parasympathetic. All parts of the plant contain poison from the leaves, flowers, and seeds to the roots that are detrimental to both animals and humans. Poisoning takes place when plant residue enters the bloodstream or gastrointestinal tract. Symptoms of poisoning in humans include dry mouth, fever, hallucinations, muscle weakness, weakness, difficulty breathing, memory loss, paralysis, and coma. If you suspect that you have been exposed to the poison of the plant, the best thing to do is contact a doctor for early treatments. Number 4. Brocina Reducta What if I told you that the pineapple has a very twisted relative? I know it's hard for us to think of a plant the same way we do of animals and human beings, but plants are also living beings, and just like us, they are also split into families. And yes, the pineapple does have a carnivorous relative, and it's called Brocina Anna Reducta, and it's called Brocinia Reducta. Both the Brocinia and the pineapple belong to the Bromeliad family, which also includes Spanish mosses and many succulents with thick leaves. The Brocinia has long pitchers that allow it to absorb and reflect ultraviolet light, which makes insects go crazy. This plant then releases a smell, like many others on this list, and the bugs can't help but come closer. And just like that, this harmless looking plant ends the lives of many insects in Colombia, Venezuela, Guyana, and Brazil. Experts in carnivorous plants were actually not sure if the plant belonged to this group, but they finally learned in 2005 that Brocinia has those distinctive enzymes that are common in animal eating plants. Number 3 castor bean plant. Castor bean is a fast-growing, tender perennial, large shrub or small tree. It grows in semi-woody large shrub or small tree. In tropic regions, the trees grow to a maximum height of 40 feet tall, developing woody stems over a few years. The plant produces a whitish bloom. In some cases, it can be red. The seed pods are much more flamboyant than the blossoms. The plant produces lots of yellow pollen, and the bees are attracted by the blossoms and the young seed pods to collect nectar. The entire plant is considered poisonous, and especially the hull of the seeds contain the extremely dangerous toxin ricin. The other parts of the plant also contain the toxin, but proportionally in low concentration. The famous castor oil, which is used to treat different skin conditions, is produced from the seed of a castor bean plant. Another significant fact to be remembered is that this ricin is 6,000 times more poisonous than cyanide, which is considered the most highly poisonous chemical in the world. Anyhow, castor seeds without the hull are used for birth control, constipation, leprosy, and syphilis. Number 2. The Venus Flytrap The Venus Flytrap is to other carnivorous plants what the Tyrannosaurus rex is to dinosaurs. Maybe not the biggest, but certainly the most well-known member of its breed. Despite what you may have seen in the movies, the Venus Flytrap is fairly small. This entire plant is no more than half a foot in length, and its sticky eye-like traps are only about an inch long. The Venus Flytrap, native to the North Carolina and South Carolina subtropical wetlands. One interesting fact about the Venus flytrap, to cut down on false alarms from falling leaves and pieces of debris, this plant's traps will snap shut only if an insect touches two different interior hairs in the course of 20 seconds. However, this isn't the most dangerous plant there is. The next one will blow your mind. Number 1. Mancineal tree. This tree, often found in Central and South America, is also sometimes called the death apple. And for a very good reason. For one thing, it supposedly killed Juan Ponce de Leon. The small apple that grows on the branches may look appetizing, but they are deadly poisonous. Even a single bite can knock you out like Snow White, but this time the kiss from the handsome prince won't wake you up. But this tree isn't just deadly if you eat from it. Even being near the mesineal tree 
can spell doom for you. Touching the trunk or sap, picking leaves, and even breathing the air in its vicinity can cause severe burns upon your skin. Get any of that in your eyes and you can go blind. If it's raining, you're in for some more trouble. The water that drips on you from the tree can injure you. Even the air around it can cause pain in your lungs, meaning that this tree is harmful and even deadly without you having to eat from it or even touch it. Which one of these plants did you find the most terrifying and also fascinating? Have you seen any in real life? Let us know in the comments. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and share it with your friends. Also, subscribe to the channel for more amazing content.